This is the Nerd Miner V2 hole set. Package set, plastic foam and box. This is the data cable. This is the Nerd Miner itself. Many people ask the function of wires and connection pins. They are used for DIY programming. If you just want to use this Nerd Miner to do solo mining, please ignore them. Before configuring Nerd Miner, please make sure your phone or your computer is connecting to the 2.4 GH frequency Wi Fi. Okay, from the Wi Fi list, you can find the Nerd Miner AP. Connect it. It will jump to the Wi Fi Manager page. Here, configure the Y. It will go to Setting page. Input your home's Wi Fi seed. The Wi Fi your phone, PC connected. The Wi Fi password. Paste your wallet address here and the time zone of your area. Click here, check up time then save. Now the Nerd Miner is trying to connect to your Wi-Fi. From here the Wi-Fi list. You cannot find the Nerd Miner AP now. If your configuration is right, the Nerd Miner will go to work. You can see, this is the real-time hash rate. Here is the pool's data. If you are so lucky to hit a block, the valid blocks will show number 1. If you want to check the working status of the Nerd Miner, you can go to the web of the pool you set and input your wallet address. You can see here the best difficulty 0 0.19. Same as here. And the block height. Here is what we said. The hash rate. The time connected. See here the hash rate curve. Single click this up button to switch the page. Single click this button to turn the screen off and on. Press off. Press on. Double click alter the orientation. Press again. Press and hold for 5 seconds to initiate a reset of your configurations and restart the device.